One of the electronic resources I've found helpful when looking for different puzzles or clues to make breakout boxes with is Kariki. This is a free website, kariki.org. You can use it without a login. You can create a login for free. And either way that you access it, you can search through their large resource library. They have it broken down, you can see, by different age levels, by different study areas. For today, I want to go in and look in the resource library for late elementary. I'm going to choose a science subject. Once I've done that, you can see you, you get a lot more advanced choices for your search. You can say that you'd like to look at biology specifically and that you'd like to include both late elementary and middle school and see what sort of projects you get. Another really nice thing down here is you can filter for the type of object you want. Maybe you just want a graph or a chart that shows something. Maybe you want an, a lesson plan or a, an organizer or maybe you want to see a whole curriculum. We'll take a look in here. We'll look at mitosis. And you can see there's an entire collection of the different information on mitosis. You can flip through here. There's some worksheets. You can see there's a lot of different things available. And here we even have something that we could use to make a breakout box. These are various questions that you could give them and if they get the right answer then that will lead them to the correct number or the correct combination that they need to, to enter their breakout box. And then if we want we can go back and look at a different area. Maybe we want to have some social studies questions. Then down here you can see that it gives you more of those subcategories. We can choose we can choose one and when I choose it it automatically updates over here. Maybe we can go in and look at stamps and we can use stamps in one of our problems. And this this happens to be a link to the Smithsonian's. This could easily be a look for the stamp that has the exact right number and has the correct type of Um, picture on it and then use that information to match up with the correct key. These kinds of things would be would easily make a small part uh, a small puzzle from a breakup box. So you can see there's a lot of different options on here. I haven't gotten into anywhere near all of the questions that are available on here. There really is a lot on this website. I encourage you to look through it and see what you can find in terms of puzzles and snips of information that you can use in a breakout box.